Hello, this video is in our mini series Parts and Pieces and we'll be talking about special pieces. Laid out here are all the miscellaneous pieces that will be explained. These are half width pieces which as you can see are only half as wide as regular pieces. They don't come in much variety because there's only a few different shapes that they come in but for some of them, those shapes, you don't find regular pieces, regular width pieces in the same shape so they can be very useful. They can be used as spacers and you can connect them with the regular pieces using these half pegs which on one side are half as big which we talked about in one of our previous videos. So you can put the full side and the regular piece and put the half piece on the half side. With these half pieces you could be very creative with a lot of them. As you can see, a lot of them have these um, these cross-shaped holes, so you can use them with axles. And especially a really cool one is this one, which we like to call the football-shaped one because it kind of looks like a football. And so you can put the axle in any of these four holes. And so there's no set thing you could do with it, like no primary function, but there's many things you could do it. These are bushings, which are these small pieces which fit through axles. They come with width of one and half. So they're used as spacers on axles, but another thing you could do with it is you can tighten these pieces on it. So you can restrict the movement from side to side by squishing it between these spacers. And it tightens it too. This is our final category for the video, brick to technique pieces. These are like regular Lego bricks with studs on top, but there's holes running through it so you could convert it to a, a beam by connecting it on. Just by putting pegs through the holes and connecting the beam. This one has a smaller width and it has the holes running through it this way, but it's the same concept. Another kind of special piece is this, which, well, we don't have any name for it, but what it does is really cool. It helps connect a beam with only round holes, not cross-shaped holes, onto axles, which normally wouldn't happen because it would just keep spinning around. But if you put this piece, the cross-shaped side, through the axle and use, and put the beam on top like this, then it would work. And now it's tightly inside, just as if this hole was a cross-shaped hole. That's all for the video. Thanks for watching.